Bayer's Wine and Spirits, our Wine of the Week this week. Return, the, re, the return of Phil, and today I brought the newest member of Bayer's Wine and Spirits, which is Todd Ross. Todd's been in a, a, a fixture in, in Annapolis wine selling for quite many years, took a little hiatus to Washington, D.C., and now he's back with us, and we couldn't be happier. Uh, and his initial Wine of the Week find is the Ben Marco 2010 Mendoza Argentina Malbec. Uh, beautiful wine vineyards, about 3,300 feet up in, up in the hills of the Andes. Um, so it gets very hot days, it gets extremely cool nights, perfect ripening uh, temperatures for this grape. Uh, but tell us a little bit about that. Oh, well, Susanna Balvo is the proprietress. Uh, proprietress. She was uh, a winemaker in Argentina years ago when, when I would say, uh, as, a, as a woman in the business, it was very difficult. But she's a pioneering winemaker in Argentina. And uh, she has her label, uh, Susanna Balbo. She makes the wines called Crios de Susanna Balbo. And then Vin Marco is another label in her in her uh, small uh, winemaking, I'll call it portfolio or empire, if you will. But uh, the Malbec's an extremely popular grape, absolutely delicious. This is a wonderful wine, 2010, very fresh, very rich wine, really deep, deep, dark cherry fruit. Uh, I think it's a wonderful wine to, uh, to enjoy with steaks or just maybe with hard cheeses, things like that. Uh, we're, uh, we have the steak is the national food of <laughs> Argentina, and, you know, and, and, their, and their vegetable is the cheese fan. Uh, but, but, but it is beautiful. I, I get just a, a teeny bit of chalk on the nose, um, maybe a little, little, little roasted, almost like a little roasted coffee bean in there. Um, and it's nice. It's a very nice mouthfeel. Um, you know, this is one of those ones, especially with the temperatures getting ready to change a little bit. You know, I think this would benefit by just being popped in, uh, being served at the proper temperature, like we do it from our wine station. But just popping that into the refrigerator for about 10, 15 minutes prior to re ready drinking would bring that down a little bit below room temperature, which is a little warm for wine uh, these days. It's, you know, uh, hopefully soon. Um, but it's, it's a gem. It's a gem. Uh, and uh, what are we talking price wise? About? Uh, the retail price, the normal retail price is $19.99, but we're selling it for $14.95 a bottle. And as far as I can tell, that's the lowest advertised price for the 2000 Tins and Marco Malbec in the United States. So yeah, we search. I mean, Wine price. Searcher and all that fun stuff. We found a couple lower prices on some older vintages. Wonder why they're cheaper, but this is the current vintage on this. It's a gym. So, um, thanks. Uh, we're trying to get some information from our director over here, and he <laughs> wants us to say it is from April 30th to March. Uh, to May 7th. I, I, I got to go forward in time, not backwards. So uh, the 30th through, through the 7th. So thanks. We'll see you next time at the wine station. Cheers.